Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Wavy and this is Just Wavy Media. And if you're a frequent surfer, a returning subscriber, there's Walt and Mickey. Um, you are more than welcome back as well. We are, of course, again in Disneyland Paris for day two. And we're going to start in Walt Disney Studios Park today. Even though you guys know it's not my favorite Disney park in the world. Potentially my least favorite Disney park in the world. But it does have a show called Mickey and the Magician and I would like to see that. So we're going to start here and then we'll go over there. Um, I don't know if I'm able to film any of that or anything. So you might literally just see this clip and then me in Disneyland. Who knows? But maybe you'll see some of Walt Disney Studios Park too. We'll see. So Mickey and the Magician is on at like 1 o'clock and it's now 12 o'clock so I got in the line for Stitch Live um, to see Stitch uh, he is on at quarter past 12 so I'm actually the first person in the line <laughs> Stitch is so popular here that nobody was here at 12 o'clock to get to see him at 12 o'clock um, but yeah, this, this, this might be fun. I don't know if I can film it. We'll see. I'm not sure. Okay, so I wasn't able to film the Stitch experience thing, but it is amazing. Uh, we did that in 2013, so it's been here for quite a long time. But like, there's a guy who is voicing Stitch and he can see the audience and he engages with the audience he talks to a child at the front Stitch talks to a child at the front and then picks one of the adults to be like the bad guy um, so they picked a guy called Patrick from the Netherlands so Stitch constantly referred to him as Mr. Patrick from the Never Neverland very very funny um, and then they pick a child that did the best monkey impression and Stitch interacts with the child too absolutely amazing really enjoyed that I'm potentially gonna go back so that's how good that was. Now over to the other place for Mickey and the Magician and hopefully I'll get into it because uh, it's about half an hour till it starts. Okay, so Mickey and the Magician was really cool. Um, and I couldn't take any videos of it, so I took pictures. But I think I'm going to do this now. Uh, it should be a single rider line, though I can't see it. So these are in Paris do a kind of a food and wine festival where they have foods from France, which was like the winter one that we saw in my last videos. I linked them above. But then they also have sorry, European ones. This is Greece. So I'm going to see so I went to the Greek booth. booth. It's called Le Rendez-vous Gourmand. Um, so that's the name of like the food and wine festival here. Le Rendez-vous Gourmand. It says it on top of these stalls over here. Uh, I went to the Greek one, and I got G Y R O gyro gyro. I don't know, but it's like chicken and stuff inside in like a pita bread. It's quite small. Um, and it was six euro, but then it's a food and wine festival, so that kind of makes sense. Uh, I don't know how I'm going to eat it and try and show you me eating it. Like the bit that's nearest my mouth is just pita, so we'll, I mean we'll try the pita bread. How do you like pita bread? Okay. I'm going to like. Be gross. I'm sorry. It's kind of like a kebab. That's nice. I like that. Hmm. Chicken kebab. Okay. Six euro. I think the taste of that is worth it. Yeah. Okay. I like this. This is good. Okay. So, Mission Walt Disney Studios complete. I saw Mickey and the Magician. So now I'm going to go back over to Disneyland for a while. Uh, I want to go and watch Dream and Shine Brighter again because. Who doesn't want to go and watch Dream and Shine Brighter again? Uh, everybody does. So that's where we're gonna go over and hang, kind of hang around Main Street and see when the next one of those is starting. Uh, might not actually be till four, but anyway, 
I'll see. That's where we're going now. We're doing work on the Disneyland Hotel. While I'm waiting for Dream and Shine Biter, I want to update you quickly on that Greek thing, pizza bread thing, wrap, kebab, yolk, goya from, um, you know, I don't know if whatever it was. Um, the, they put raw onions in it, and so now all I can taste is raw onions, and it's kind of gross. So there must have been a lot of raw onion in it. Um, might have been better if they slightly grilled them or something. I don't know. Maybe that would be sacrilege to do for that sort of dish. But uh, yeah, there's a serious aftertaste of onion. Okay, so Dream and Shine Brighter is about to happen in a few minutes. The best place I think to watch it is from in the hub, where in other Disney parks the Parker statue is, but it's not here. Um, because it happens all around you, which is really cool. So I've only really ever watched it from like here or when I randomly caught glimpses of it on Main Street. Um, but yeah, this is the place to watch it from. just was doing some pin trading over the trading post. Um, I got a new Ian pin from Onward and a new uh, Sorcerer Mickey and then also a new, what was the other one? I can't remember what the third one was. Oh, Hades. It was a Hades. Um, so that was fun. And then I traded with a cast member as well. Uh, but I think the one I traded with a cast member is fake. And then I was also on Pirates of the Caribbean in the front row, so it got wet. It's so much more fun in the front row. And now I'm, it's like 6 p.m. and I'm really hungry, but I have a dinner reservation at eight. So, is it six? Yeah, it's going on six. Um, it's like two more hours. <sighs> Decided for a little break on the Molly Brown. Uh, with views of the Big Thunder Mountain, we're gonna go around it. So here in Disneyland Paris, there is no Tom Sawyer's Island. There is Big Thunder Mountain on an island, and the rivers of America goes around that.
just up there on Main Street. Look, I found Tigger. He's like stamping books inside in the storybook shop. That's so cute. A Tigger animatronic. So I've just had my dinner in Plaza Gardens with some character dining and it was really fun and it was expensive and I'm stuffed. Um, I will put the video here when it's out and yeah now I'm in Discoveryland uh, which is Disneyland Paris's Tomorrowland. We haven't actually done like a video on this area but I don't know if I could. Um, I guess I could just show you what the attractions are. But anyway, it's based on like Jules Verne's sort of steampunk discovery as opposed to like futuristic -y stuff. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go on Star Tours now because it says it's a five minute wait. So that sounds good. There's also a spirit jersey out. I'm wearing a Star Wars spirit jersey, the Jedi one, uh, Skywalker Academy, which I really like. I love this, like the white bits in the blue on this is really nice and the red and white on the arm I like too. Um, it says Skywalker Academy on the back. But there is a new spirit jersey that is even more my favorite color uh, that is out. So I'm gonna go on Star Tours and then if they have it in my size, I'm gonna get that spirit jersey because I really want it. Um, I, I've been looking at it online for a little while, but they haven't brought it out in on Shop Disney EU yet, so. Uh, I haven't gotten it because I haven't really wanted to do or had enough things to do in order from the US recently because I've been saving money for this. Uh, so I'm going to get it now uh, because I get a 10% discount as well with my annual pass. So that's nice. So first Star Tours and then I'll show you guys that Spirit Jersey um, before I buy it, when I buy it, or after I buy it. You will see the Spirit Jersey probably in the next clip because I won't show you Star Tours. The cast member here at the entrance to Star Tours um, just had this like little pouch in on, in front of him with a little baby Grogu in it that was like an animatronic. It moved and things. I don't know if it's like one you could buy or he just has it himself. Um, but it was really, really cool and really cute. It's generic outro time because you know me, I've probably forgotten to film. I think I filmed maybe one or two, roughly about eight videos, uh, outros. So um, this is it. That is all we have time for. Thank you so much for joining me today and I hope you liked the video. If you did, please give it a like. Subscribe to keep the tide coming in. Click that notification bell so you know the next time I post a video. There are more Disneyland Paris videos. There's a whole other trip. I will link the playlist above for you to watch them all. Both trips will be on the one playlist. And thank you for surfing on a channel that's just wavy enough for surfing. I hope you have a magical day, guys. Take care and I'll see you real soon.